All right, guys, Chris here with uh, Armatan Quads. Uh, that's a CNC 258 here. Um, it's got a multi wheel program to have uh, reversed um, rotation on the propellers, on the motors. And it's got uh, uh, reversed um, Simon KESCs as well, the firmware for reversing uh, the motor rotation program programmed into the ESCs so what this is essentially made to do is it's supposed to be able to hover upside down I've had quite a bit of difficulties um, getting the propellers right in order to actually get enough lift when I'm inverted uh, these uh, propellers now are 7 inch long but they were actually 8 inch props that I cut at the end flattened them, balanced them and it's working better for me, although uh, there's still nowhere near as much lift uh, as I would get with normal propellers in just the upright position, but, but it's working. And I believe there are some propellers uh, that are not being produced, uh, and they should be available on the market soon, and I think that this is going to make a very big difference once we can get the proper propellers on there, um, you know, to create, to have the equal amount of lift upright and uh, inverted. That said, I think you're still going to get less lift and less efficiency than you would with normal props flying upright uh, because you're missing that camber into the propellers which do help create more lift and make, make essentially make this these propellers more efficient. But uh, I think it's still going to be a very big improvement over these props and might very well make the, the, the experience well worth, you know, having fun with and, and practicing this uh, inverted flying which is by the way a heck of a lot harder of course it's like, uh, like when you start flying upside upside down with a heli 3d heli you know all your controls are mirrored once you're you're upside down so it, you know it's definitely some getting used to and uh, that's where I'm at now I, I'm really not really good at flying this at the moment but I'll try to keep it up keep it up in the air for a bit anyways to show you guys uh, most likely will crash uh, I tested this in my backyard area last little while and what I found is that the area was so small it didn't give me much time to think whereas now I'm hoping if I keep it high enough I should be able to think about this and hopefully keep it up in the air a bit longer so let's see Hopefully the camera's at the right angle now. Last time I made a video, you barely could see it. I had the camera too low on my forehead. Need to remember to hit the switch. As you can see, I got some uh, practice to do here. But, uh, yeah work in progress let's get more altitude, let's get this thing further away from myself Batteries, my batteries are so bad, it's ridiculous. Mind you, when I'm inverted, I need to go full rotation. I got some propellers touching here. Let me have a look. What's touching what? Oh, propeller is actually, was bent on the corner. It looks like it was touching the top of my receiver. Alright, let's try that again. Oh! Cut the throttle! God, this is the brain not working.
Okay. I'm telling you, man, this is tough. Looks like I just did some damage to my battery here. Um, let's plug that back in. See if see if it'll go up again. Put a new battery in here. I've got uh, slightly bent arms from the last crash here. Just bear with me here. By far my most successful attempt. Wah! All right, so it's official. I totally suck at flying 3D. It's a good thing this frame is tough. Wouldn't last long. The plastic frame, that's for sure. battery that's how bad my batteries are like it's ridiculous I so need to buy batteries pretty sure the battery's dead it's 3.9 on the meter but as soon as you give it some juice Brutal. I'll tell you what though, man, this is a pretty good testimonial as the sturdiness of my frames. So there's kind of a purpose to bashing this thing like that. no more power so that's it guys battery's out um, as you can see it's uh, it's working I mean I can't fly it for if my soul if my life depended on it um, but I'm getting better frankly I'm about 10 times better than the first time I tried I'm gonna go straighten a couple arms on there now um, put on a new battery and then uh, Keep trying. Alright, hope you enjoyed the video. Cheers.